I'm Kevin Pearson with the East Kermune Municipal Water District. I'm joined by Juan Zamora from our Conservation Department. Juan, thanks for joining us today. It's a pleasure to be here. During the drought, a lot of people have asked us, you know, how do I maintain my property while still conserving water? Uh, what's the one thing people can do to really maintain their landscape but water as efficiently as possible? Well, the best way is actually to uh, measure moisture in the ground. Um, uh, grass is the highest water user and we tend to overwater it just by nature. So checking the moisture in the ground is the best way. And how would people go about checking the moisture within the ground? Well, there's a couple different ways, and but one of the most simplest is to use a little moisture sensor. Just stick it in the ground and it'll give you a reading as to whether it's too wet or too dry, and then you can decide whether to water. Okay, so the simple way of doing this is you take your um, moisture meter and very simply stick it in the ground. It's got a reading from dry to wet. And as soon as you stick it in the ground a few inches, it'll, it'll give you that reading, just like this. And in this case, uh, my reading says wet. Part of that is because it did water early this morning and therefore it does not need to be watered again. To understand the water needs of different plant types, be sure to refer to the packaging on your soil moisture meter or check with your local nursery provider for more information. Are there any other tips that you can give uh, our customers in order to maintain their landscape during the drought? There is a couple, uh, but specifically one of them is make sure that when you do mow, you can leave your grass a little bit taller than, than usual. What that does, it creates more shade, which in turn uh, doesn't allow the water to evaporate as quickly. Wonderful. And you can pick up a soil moisture meter at any home improvement store. They're sold online as well. They're just a few bucks. And it's one way that you can really help control your water usage during this drought.